Student performance is a pivotal reason for the strategic plan, but there is no single measure that tells us how much students are learning and growing. We need several measures of student achievement and growth in order to evaluate progress. For elementary school students, peak to peak uses the iReady assessments in the subject areas of math and literacy to assess student performance and progress. The iReady assessment is also used at the middle school level to examine student achievement and growth. This data is combined with the PSAT testing results for 8th graders and data on student grades for 6th, 7th, and 8th graders. At the high school level, in addition to student grades for 9th through 12th grade, data from several other KPIs are layered in. These include PSAT and SAT testing for 10th and 11th graders respectively, AP participation, college acceptance, and graduation rates. Together, the KPI data from these many sources combine to paint a broad picture of student performance and growth at peak to peak. For this video, let's take a closer look at student grades. At the secondary level, that's middle school and high school, or 6th through 12th grade students, we examine the distribution of student grades across all coursework. Because peak to peak uses a standards-based grading model in all courses, we can rely on the objectivity of student grades as a measure. We want our students to be successful during their time at peak to peak and we want to motivate behaviors among our staff and teachers that support that success. That's why we strive for 80% of course grades to be A's and B's, which is the minimum threshold for this KPI. This KPI also has a maximum threshold for the number of failing grades. We have established that less than 3% of course grades should be F's. And remember, peak to peak does not use D's in our grading scale. By establishing these thresholds and monitoring student grade distribution, we strive to motivate student learning and to better understand the culture of achievement at peak to peak. You can further explore these KPIs and the related data in the peak to peak strategic plan.